Hey, right slipper. Yo, right slipper. Hello, Mr. Beatboxer. Are you hearing me? Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Ba, 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 ba. Hey, Mr. Singer. Are you hearing me? I be going places, different freaking places, moving like a like a like a tortoise, going in the waters, looking by the sharks. They be look for blood, and I give them blows. I'm like Mr. Goku. I be in a Zoku. Yeah. Um. Now that you've done all your shenanigans, can you listen to me? Who's that? Oh, Lev Slipper. I didn't notice you. <laughs> Yeah, you didn't notice me, hey? After every single time I said you did this, you did another thing. So, it's like a slap on the door frame. Slap on the door, and you make say something that dumb. You know what you were doing, right, Slipper? I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, besides that, um... You look a bit dirty. Haven't you, why haven't you taken a bath in such a long time? Right back at you. Because I have been taking baths. Really? Yes, really. Are you really sure about that? Yes, I'm sure about that. <sighs> you know, when you grow older, you would change your appearance completely. Of course, of course. I'll be able to grow a beard. I'll look a bit new. Uh, I'll look completely different. But I'll still be the same lip slipper. So never forget that. Wait, why do I sound like a character in a movie? Hey, why are you changing up the whole subject entirely? Uh-uh, answer the question. Why were you ignoring me with your beatboxing, rapping, singing, vocals, and... I don't know if you'd set a poem. Sally sat on the scratchy mat. That didn't even make sense. I know, right? And that's what makes it all the better. You know what? You're just being out of character right now. You're saying stupid things that you usually would never, ever, ever, ever say, right, Slipper? <sighs> and so what if I am? But that's not like you at all. <sighs> I guess you don't know me well enough then. After all this time, you thought I was just a sibling who was smart, clever, always pissed off at you because you said dumb grammar. But you know, I also have my own side of life too, where I also have fun, right? You can't expect me to always be shouting at you. It's not like everywhere I go, I see you. No, I don't. It's way different. Can you explain to me why it's so different when you're not around me? I can. I and I can't. And this is so true. But you know, when you when you're with your sibling, right? I'm with you right now, so yes. Well, when you're with your sibling, um, how do I say this? You're with them almost 24-7. And if it's the holidays, it is 24-7. So, you, they, the annoying shenanigans they do, everything that will piss you off, they do it 24-7. Seven days a week. Four weeks in a month, 12 months in a year, every single year, for what, you don't know how long, but yeah, just that long, and so now when you're going outside, meeting a stranger, and you become friends, let's say you don't know each other outside of school, right, outside of college, you just know that person at college, which means once you leave that place, even if they annoyed you, they, they, they're gone, so they're gone. Like, they're not going to be there for the rest of the hours that you're gone away from college, which means they don't bother you as much as a sibling can. That's why it's so easy for, like, siblings just to argue a lot because, like, bro, at the end of the day, it's just 24-7 torture. <laughs> And you just can't bear it. 
I don't annoy you. Except for that time, I did not annoy you. 